Hey girls, welcome back to my channel. My name is Arezi. If you're new here, and today we will be unwinding using my favorite shower products for this self care night routine. First, I'm lighting a candle for the ambient and to create spa vibes, and just honestly to relax. Candles help me a lot. And then I'm gonna put my bonnet on just to protect my hair, and then it's time to get into the shower. So, when I first get into the shower, I wet my skin and just to open the pores and allow for my body to be clean and then i'm going to go in with the dr bronner's baby unscented pure castile soap this um first i'm going to pre-cleanse my underarms this will get the deodorant off and the odor especially in this heat i make sure to pre-wash my underarms because it's the first thing on my body that sweats and that creates like a lot of funk and must and honestly it allows for my arms to be fresher once I go on with that double cleanse and then I go ahead and rinse that off and then I go in for a full body cleanse with the Dr. Bronner soap. I love Dr. Bronner soap. Oh my god. It is so much more moisturizing than Dow but still gives that same effect, that same amount of cleanness. It is extra soapy. You only need a little bit and you are getting your money's worth and lasts a long time it's this product the one i'm using now um, it is saved for your body parts your private parts and it really will show you how clean you are so this is necessary this product out of everything is necessary to get rid of odor funk and mustiness and it will last you a very long time so i love this product um, then i make sure to go ahead and rinse that off really good because now it's time to use the next shower product and all i have to say is please go pick this up out of everything please go pick this up so next i'm going to be using this dove sensitive skin so i don't know what it is but lately sometimes i'll be feeling like even though it's summer and it's hot my skin gets dry and i just like at night i just like to be moisturized and just you know my skin is super soft, so I love Dove Sensitive Skin. It barely has a scent. It leaves my skin moisturized. My skin is sensitive, and sometimes it'll break out in like rashes, or even sometimes I have flare ups of eczema, and this will literally take it right away. So I really do recommend this product. So next, I'm gonna go in with the Exfoliating Body Polish and Macadamia Nuts and Rice Milk. Um, a lot of people have been saying that this isn't really exfoliate, but this is really just like a moisturizing like body polish I don't know how to explain it it does exfoliate but it's a very light exfoliant which is perfectly fine because sometimes I feel like the tree hut scrub is just too exfoliating like too abrasive on the skin so next I'm gonna go on with the Aveeno daily um, moisturizing spray on my body because oh my god this gives me that glow and also i like to do this before i go on with my lotions because this also helps lock in that moisture as well before i actually get out the shower then i'm going to go on with the jergens original scent i love this scent it always gives like you know clean scents and that's really what this um shower routine is about next i'm going to go in with alcohol to really get in behind my ears and just clean the earwax out um, i notice sometimes when i have protective styles in like this one like i have ponytail in or even braids it's hard to really like wash behind my ears in the shower so i like to go ahead and do that separately so next i'm going to start on with my skincare routine just picked up this Pond's Cold Cream Makeup Remover and my Come Hygiene Shopping With Me, which will be linked above. Definitely go ahead and watch it. But this erases all of your makeup, all of your waterproof makeup, and this is good for a pre-cleanse before you go ahead and cleanse your face, even if you have makeup on and even if you don't. I am sold by this product. It is oil-based a little bit, so if you do have oily skin, this is great, and if you have dry skin, this is amazing. I love this product. It literally allows for my cleanser to just be a cleanser. So all once you're done with um, rubbing the product in, all you have to do is get a cotton pad and just wipe it away, and all your makeup will come off it blew me away like i was like oh my god i can finally like not cleanse my face like three times look at all that makeup it got off and that was so quick 
it normally takes me like a cool 10 minutes just to get my makeup to come off using a regular cleanser so yeah say goodbye to wipes makeup wipes i'm like so over them so now it's time to put my arm cuffs on because we're about to cleanse our face and girl i'm so glad i purchased these arm cuffs they will be linked in my description box in my amazon storefront oh my god water no longer runs down my arms and on the floor amazing so now i'm going to just cleanse my face using core c o r s x products course x products they are amazing they're so amazing their products work amazing for my skin and i'm also going to be using a cleansing pad that i also have from amazon that's going to be linked below this has also changed my life i no longer use cleansing brushes i no longer use scrub brushes on my face i literally just use a cleansing pad um, and it works really good and they're disposable and great for sensitive skin Now I'm going to be scrubbing my lips. I either use a lip scrub or I use the back of a toothbrush. And I love smooth, moisturized, plump, pink lips. So I always try to aim for that. I love to scrub my lips a lot. And after I do that, I'm just going to go ahead and brush my teeth. I use Optic White with my electric toothbrush. That combo saves the day my teeth look so white and i feel so clean and my breath is so fresh i use the grin double floss just because my teeth are strong especially my back teeth and the smooth one just doesn't do me justice i need to get between my teeth and just get rid of that plaque and that's why i love this one i also habitually use the grin tongue scrapers just because they're disposable and they get rid of bad breath i'm telling you then i'm going to go into their breath invigorating icy mint the best one out of all of them and this gets rid of bad breath this mouthwash is the best it doesn't burn it doesn't hurt and it literally does a job so now it is time to gua sha i only gua sha at night and my secret is to actually put the gua sha under hot water just to get the skin and the blood cells warmed up in the face because we all have face muscles that we are not interacting with on the daily and I love a nice chiseled jawline and doing these face exercises have helped me not only look more youthful and younger than obviously I am but they have actually like helped my skin become tighter so now I'm going to go in with some dark spot cream and just kind of put that on my dark spots and hyperpigmentation. And I'm going to go in with the Vaseline Rosy Lips, my favorite all time lip mask slash lip gloss slash kind of moisturize my lips. So then I'm going to go in with the Eco Styler Clear Gel to do my hair at night. I've been noticing that doing my hair takes a lot of time and I really want to start saving time especially in the morning so I take that time at night to do my edges which take me the longest in the morning just because I'm so like I, I'm like a perfectionist I like have to have it a certain way and so I like to I'm starting to do my hair at night and that is saving me a bunch of time so that's what I'm starting to do and then I also am going to put a scarf on even though I have silk pillow sheets I have to have my hair and my edges laid so just gonna go put that on just because once I do that in the morning my hair is just gonna be looking the way it's supposed to look and it's not gonna be frizzy and there's not gonna be any pieces standing out and also it saves oil from getting on the pillow sheets and then I'm wearing this pajama set from Target and it's so cute and then I'm just gonna blow out this candle that smelled so good and gave us all the vibes that we needed for the night and now it is time to leave the bathroom and make us some tea so when I'm actually intentionally trying to go to sleep it is actually hard for me because I am truly a workaholic most of the time so 
I have to make myself go to sleep. So I'm just making me some tea so that I can fall asleep and not try to create more content than already what I have. So I'm going to make some tea and just wind down for the night. And then also what I have loved to do to save time in the morning and my day is to literally write down a to-do list for the next day and everything that I need to complete because it saved me so much time. And also I have also started to take my vitamins at night which has actually helped me be more consistent with taking my vitamins. Thank you girls so much for watching this video. If you do like more self-care content, be sure to go ahead and like this video, comment down below, and definitely go ahead and subscribe. And I will catch you in another video. Bye-bye.